Hey, how's it going everyone? So, as you can see, I'm on this beautiful, beautiful nature walk right now. Um, amazing trail that I'm walking down right now. And I was just thinking this is probably a perfect time to go over what, just a quick video for you guys um, about something I was thinking about. Um, so basically this video is titled, You Are Good Enough. And a lot of people, um, when they're grinding, going towards success, um, in whatever goals that they have, in whatever endeavors that they have, they'll find that they, they tend to burn out, especially when they fail on one thing and, you know, try to go after another thing, they fail again, they try to go after another thing, fail again, and then they just give up. And the reason for this is that they don't believe inside themselves that they are good enough no matter what. Now, I know a lot of you have probably heard this, and it's pretty generic, um, but I'm actually, if you stay till the end of the video, I'll give you some practical tips to, to put forward in your life that you can use. So it's not just a bunch of, uh, you know, philosophy. And um, it's something that you can actually put forward in your life to, to improve things if you're going through this. Now, basically, when you're grinding after things, and you're going after your goals, whether it's in business or whatever it is. Um, I'm trying to think of how, to, how to say this. So when you don't believe that you're good enough, you you believe that your accomplishments will will give you that feeling. The accomplishments that you have in business or whatever will give you that feeling of success. So then you'll finally be good enough. And this is a res recipe for failure. This is why you see um really rich people really rich business people still sad because they they thought that the success were gonna was gonna give them the feeling of happiness and peace that they were looking for and it's just not the case now you can you can think this all along and it's hard to it's hard to think otherwise because you're looking at your life and you're like wow i don't have much right now if i just had these things then everything would be good and in some ways that is the case, but in a lot of ways it's not because when you when you go after these things and you finally achieve them, your brain is just going to push the bar further. It's just gonna push things further away from you. Literally in a split second, you might be appreciative for a second. Forgive me, I'm just looking around just cause there's so many animals around here. I don't wanna get like eaten by a predator or something. <laughs> but um, there's, um, you're, you'll push the bar further, right? So for a split second, you might be very appreciative of the, of the things that you've achieved, but it'll go away so fast because you have this underlying feeling that you're just not good enough. And, and it lingers. So no matter how much you get, you're constantly going to be pushing the bar forward. You're gonna be pushing it forward no matter what. You get a certain amount of money that you've been looking for. Let's just say you wanna make a hundred grand a year. You make that, it's not gonna be enough. You're gonna want 200 grand a year. You get to 200 grand a year, you're gonna want a million a year and so on. Now, the only way to fix this issue and to get out of this loop, this rat race, this trap that you're in is to know within you that no matter what you have, no matter what you've achieved, you are good enough. And, and that's the main secret. And I know a lot of you have heard this kind of thing. It's pretty generic to just believe in yourself. And the fake it till you make it philosophy is basically wrapped around this idea. You don't need to fake it till you make it, but the real gold within the philosophy is that you need to believe that you are enough. And it's very hard to do when you don't have things. When you don't have a lot of things, it's really hard to do because you see other people with a lot of things and you're like, okay, maybe I am not good enough. Maybe I suck because they have all that and I don't. And you're on a you're on a you're on a bad path because you're setting yourself up for failure. Because let's just say you even you even get success with the first thing that you try, which is very rare. Most people fail and they have to fail again to get more things. But let's just say you get success. You're gonna push the bar for, forward and you're still not gonna feel good enough. So no matter how much you have, you're just gonna keep pushing the bar forward and never feel good enough. So it's just a recipe for failure. The only way out of that 
And the only way to truly be content and happy with what you have and to move forward progressively and not move backwards and give up when you fail is to know that within you that you are enough. And I know a lot of you have heard this kind of thing before, like I said. So I don't want to leave you with just some generic video that, you know, you're good enough and and that's it and just figure it out so i'm going to leave you guys with some practical tips um practical tips for people that that you it doesn't cost any money so tip number one is to fix your sleep schedule and a lot of people are not on a consistent sleep schedule where they wake up with the sun and they go to sleep when the sun is down that's number one now some studies have said that um, sleep is more important than diet for weight loss. So sleep is so important. It's going to get your mind right. It's going to allow you to be content with, with work and, and wake up rested and just feel good about your day throughout the day with whatever you have to do. Sleep is probably the most important pillar of the three pillars, in my opinion, that I'm going to speak about today for life. So sleep is just number one. If your sleep isn't in check, you're never gonna get anywhere with anything. Whether it's fitness, business, or whatever, you gotta have your sleep in check. I know there's a lot of businessmen out there that speak about sleeping for four hours a day, and maybe they did it, I don't know. But I'm telling you right now that chances are it's just not going to work. And even for them, they're gonna burn out at some point. So sleep is number one. Number two is diet. Now that's number two to sleep because sleep is most important. If your sleep is right, then your diet will, will fall in line. If you're eating too much, you might be staying up super late and eating those late night snacks or whatever, what have you. Diet is number two. Now I'm not, I'm not saying be like, you know, super fitness minded, but just try to focus on what you're putting in your body because it's, it affects your mind. I've heard something like, something like every 28 days the cells that are in your body are made up off of the the food that you ate 28 days ago so just try to keep that in mind when when you're eating just whatever you put in your body is going to be the cells that are in your brain and it's going to be what you think um the you know the quote that everyone's heard is you are what you you are what you eat so just try to keep that in mind number three is exercise now, like I said, these are probably the basics that everyone's heard, but you got to hear it again, because if you're not sleeping, if you're not eating right, and if you're not exercising, you're not going to feel good about yourself. And it's the, it's the thing that I got to bring up because these are the practical steps that everyone can take that don't cost anything that are going to allow you to feel good about yourself and allow you to feel that you are good enough because that's, that's the main, that's the main core piece to allow you to keep going even when you're failing because when you're going after a big goal you're going to fail 10,000 times over you're going to fail for 10 years straight until you become an expert in whatever field that you're you're going after so you're going to have to be energized and you're going to have to have a nice baseline of knowing that it really doesn't matter what whether you fail or not you're good enough to know that you can keep going because if you allow accomplishment in your head to be to be the, the factor that allows you to feel happiness, then you'll never feel, feel happy. You're always gonna need to accomplish more to feel happy. And that's just a recipe for failure because no one can, no one can bat 100. No one can, no one can hit 100% threes, you know what I mean? And it's just, it's a recipe for failure. So sleep, diet, exercise are the top three and I think if you get if you if you guys actually put yourself put your mind to it and put these things in action, it's pretty hard to not feel good about yourself already. If you're a healthy person, um, you're you're gonna feel great, and it's it's gonna lead you to that feeling that you are good enough. And that's really all this video is about today. And I wanted to do it while I was on this nature walk because it's things like this that are gonna allow you to feel grounded, feel one with nature, feel one with yourself, and allow the the rest of the world and other people's accomplishments to just get out of your head while you focus on just, you know, living a healthy life. And, you know, just, just, this, this is, this is what humans are meant to do. And just walk, walk through nature, be one with nature and, you know, not to get all, you know, weird and like spiritual with you guys, but that's, that's what it is. 
and we all came out of a rock at the end of the day. So for you in your life, you want the rock, the foundation to be as solid as possible. So the things that come out of it are just set up for success and that's it. So just remember, if you're listening to this, you are good enough. For me, it took so long to figure that out because I constantly just wanted more. I was like, dude, I'm tired of hearing this this talk about I'm good enough and stuff. Like, no, I'm not, I, have, I don't have shit. I don't have money, I, I need money, I need all this, I need to make a business, I need to do all this. And the sad reality is that no, I don't. I really don't. I'm good enough how I am. I don't need to compare myself to others. I don't need money, I don't need anything to tell me that I'm good enough. And the same goes for you guys. So, you know, just keep grinding guys. Uh, if you need something to start out with, with exercise, just go on a, go on a nature walk, maybe go a mile for one day next week try two miles and just keep going up for there maybe start jogging after like a month you don't need to go super hard just start getting your mind geared towards like you know sleep diet and exercise and that that type of thing will just lead you in the right direction and uh yeah that's all i wanted to say you guys are good enough i promise you i appreciate you guys for watching and uh i'll see you guys in the next video peace